it's okay. You're not going to hurt yourself. You're not you're just going deeper into the muscle. Hey, it's Liam. I uh, just got my first testosterone shot. Pretty fucking stoked. Um, today is April 26th. Uh, 2017, yeah, uh, I live uh, in Canada, BC, Vancouver Island, um, yeah, it's just, it's a great day, and so, yeah, this is my first tea video, I guess, and yeah, I'm 24 years old. Hey, I'm Liam, um, just giving you guys an update. Uh, today's May 11th, 2017. I've been on testosterone officially two weeks now. Just had my third shot yesterday. Um, I give myself shots. Uh, injection in my thighs uh, once a week with 0.5 milligrams. Um, and that's been going well. I don't mind giving myself shots. So, that's good. Um, yeah, anyways, uh, having no, no sickness feeling or anything, which has been nice after shots. Uh, my stomach gargles a little bit, but usually like an hour after the shot. Um, but besides that, it's been, it's been going really well. Um, yeah, as far as changes in the last two weeks, um, a lot more energy. Um, I just don't even need a coffee in the morning. I just get up and and I go and I got energy all day which has been a really nice change um yeah and also much higher sex drive uh I've noticed kind of different not so much scent but I've noticed I had a shower more um lately just just different body odor uh not like bad just just sweat more and you know, you want to shower more, so that's different. Um, uh, my voice hasn't changed, I don't think, but I noticed when I was listening to my Tool CD in the car that I can't hit the high notes anymore, so, I mean, that's that's good. Uh, but also sucks, because when you can't, you know, have the same tone to your favorite song, but that that's just one of those changes, I guess. Um, yeah, and... Besides that, a uh, lot more, uh, definitely increased uh, appetite. Um, like, like I get up for work 5 a.m. and I'm like, already got the munchies by 6 a.m. Um, and I'm just constantly eating and I don't know where it's going, so that's good. Um, yeah, and I've just been, been really happy lately. Um, uh, feeling more more like self-love and confidence because if I look back six months ago I was just really just uh just really down and I just wasn't really happy especially with myself I really was not happy with myself um it's not like my life's bad my life's great um it's just how I felt about myself and everything but that's changing and I can tell just how I'm looking at things differently and more positive. Um, so that's that's been good. That's I feel I feel brighter. Uh, but yeah, there's there's no physical changes that I'm aware of yet. But it's you know it's it's hard to tell though because you look at yourself every day, and you hear your voice whenever you talk, and so it, it's hard to notice the difference. The only time I've noticed any difference in any of that is my voice not hitting high notes, <laughs> but I'm, it's also exciting too, so, um, yeah, um, besides that, uh, the last month my life has changed quite a bit, um, in a lot of ways, uh, I just moved in with three girls, one who is now my girlfriend, and she's so rad. Um, but I have, like, the best roommates ever. They're gorgeous and just, just awesome souls. Um, so, it's been good, and, and we live just right by the beach, and, yeah, I'm just super happy. Uh, 
And not only that, but I got a really awesome job uh, as a groundskeeper recently in the last month. And and pretty much where I was working months ago, I was just a miserable fuck. And I hated it. And it had a lot to do with my negative attitude, I think. But I got this new job, and I'm excited to get up, even though it's at 5 a.m. <laughs> but it it's good. And, and, you know, it's those life changes that that you have to, to make to make yourself happy and make yourself actually want to be where you are and who you're with and all the rest. So that's, that's the change I made and I'm really glad I did because I'm, I'm, I feel happy. Uh, yeah. And as far as support from everybody, it's, it's been nothing but awesome. Um, from my girlfriend, my roommates, friends, uh, everybody's like putting in the effort to to call me Liam and to use pronouns like him and his and this and that. Um, and I have been noticing more this week. They'll be like, "Oh, Jenna, oh, oh, I mean Liam," and you know, just the fact that they're putting in that effort really, really has a great impact, and I really appreciate it. Um, so. Yeah, uh, so really stoked about that. Um, I'm not, I'm not like in a big rush for people to, to get it right, you know, like my name. Uh, it's going to take a while, like, uh, just family and all that. Like, they've known me for 24 years and I don't expect them to just call me Liam and use pronouns just like that, you know, because they, they look at me how they always have and, I mean slowly it'll change and they'll get used to it and I'll get used to it but I'm not I'm not trying to push it you know on anybody because they'll 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 get it when they get it and that's fine by me so um yeah so the whole name thing it's it's slow but it's it's going how it should so I'm pretty stoked um and it's been really nice because my my roommates are pretty much calling me um, Liam full time and using all the pronouns and all that effort and making guy jokes and you know like I go have a shower and use Old Spice and they all like run into the shower and <laughs> they like the smell of it because it's like living with a guy so it's it's pretty cool I like it um uh yeah and and not only that but the other day um because I deliver pizza at night, and my boss, I guess, went into my file and changed my name to Liam and all that, and all my coworkers there are starting to use the pronouns, and it just, it makes me smile, because, you know, you just see that effort that people put in to make you happy and make you feel comfortable and everything, and it's, I'm just really grateful. Um, yeah, uh, Everything's just going great, and I'm I'm in a really happy place, and uh, I'm I'm just really excited for everything else that will slowly eventually come. And I'm not trying to rush it. I'm not trying to be impatient. I'm just I'm just enjoying it as it comes. And uh, I don't know exactly when things are gonna you know start happening, but I I know it's gonna be soon. And I'm trying not to to pry at it with my mind because then I'll get impatient and then I'll get stressed out and that's not what I want so anyways it's been a long day but um yeah um if you have any questions feel free to talk to me or concerns or point of views or any of that anyways I'll uh, have an update video in probably like a month or two uh like my one one or two month on T period and I'll make another video that'll be awesome and hope you watch it. Cool. Thank you for watching.